Asmin is talking live on stream with her mod who says her third monitor is strictly for chat apparently. Oh god. Wait, what? Why, why isn't she defending herself? It, it, not that that's possible. It's... it's... <laughs> it's 100% irrefutable that she faked it. Like, it's happening right now, let me see. ...with Mitriz, the blindfold expert who's been helping her with the setup and everything that we went through. Mm -hmm. I'm happy to answer any questions regarding her Maybe setup. Zero. There is no need for anyone to lie about anything or not be transparent. She did nothing wrong. She did not cheat anything. She has not cheated anything. And I understand that there is a lot of skepticism. I understand there's a lot of questioning. And I think that it's important for us to understand that conjecture does not equal proof. There is no physical It's not conjecture. What? There's a lot of conjecture. There's a lot of there is proof, many irrefutable that proof on the table that are that people claim oh, she did this, she moved that, she did. But there's there's no actual proof that any of this happened. Well, there's no proof that it and, did and, either. Wait, what? I, that, wait, that's what a bunch of baloney. That that is the proof. No one can go there physically and like gather evidence from the crime scene. All you can do is base it on what she has posted. Huh? That is irrefutable proof. What would it take to prove that she is indeed legitimate? If it meant covering the third monitor, showing a camera with all three monitors, and showing that there are no other monitors present, showing that she's still wearing the exact same blindfold that was recommended by a world expert used by Mitra's and Bubzia themselves, you know, what does it take? Because I know for a fact that she can do this. She's done it not once, not twice, <laughs> but several times. Her second attempt is a purely legitimate run that was done with every specification that Mitch Riz mentioned. And it's met with nothing but criticism, which I, again, I understand. I don't think that it's unreasonable to be skeptical. But I think that to bend an argument to fit your purpose is not appropriate. To say that, oh, this is what must have happened because this is what I believed happened. When it didn't happen, she's being accused of a crime she didn't commit. And I know that for a fact. I'm willing to. I'm willing to put money on it. I will so, take you up on that. I, I'll take him up on that 100. percent It is irrefutable evidence. Here's how she can prove it. She goes to a, a completely neutral setup, a single monitor, one monitor, completely covered, same blindfold, and even put like a piece of tape so that, you, that way you can't see anything out the bottom of it, and then do it again. And I would put money that she can't. That is the freest bet of all time. It is irrefutable proof. I don't know why he's yapping about that. Circumstance. It's not conjecture. My understanding, of the, my understanding of the psychological body language, whenever that happens, people usually actually huddle up more to protect their like their mid body because that's where your organs are. That's where mm, that's, you know. Uh, I shouldn't have muted because well, now I'm, I'm lost in this. I'm a physician. You, you don't. That's not. That's not true. true. It's not entirely no, it's not true. Well, which true. one is more no, true not... than the other? Well, people have different physiological responses to stress. Sure. And so, so her changing her body position, her head position, is in in one way or another. It, it doesn't mean that she's trying to position herself to see something or to maneuver something. I mean, if you, I, I wouldn't, I would even, I'd ha be happy to send you the same blindfold she used. It has nothing to do with the blindfold. To do what she's been accused of doing. And to Someone see did do that. Difficult that would even. Well, I, mean, be I could barely do it with the blindfold off. All right, so I don't. I don't want to get that far. And and, and uh, congratulations, by the way. Yeah, we're yeah. we're all very happy for you for, yeah, for I getting that kill. Oh, this, okay. This this is this is a bunch of delusional cope here. What? I can't believe that this is even as big of an issue as it is. It, it is. It's not conjecture. There. What he just said. Someone has already done to prove how she faked it. That's that's just crazy to me. But, so apparently that is one of her mods that's talking about how this is all, you know, a bunch of baloney. That she did do this legitimately and no matter what, no one's believing her. Even though Carl and the community have proven exactly how she cheated with irrefutable evidence. Thanks, membership, Zachary. Again, if she wants to prove that it's legitimate... She goes to a neutral setup. Maybe Carl sets something up or someone sets something up. It's a single monitor. Cover the monitor. Even, you know what? She can even face away from the monitor. 
blindfold on, piece of tape under it so that way you can't see through the bottom. Stay in a neutral position. Look straight down. You don't need to be, like, doing anything special with your head, right? It's blindfold. Look straight down. And then just and do it there. It, it should be easy. If it's real. Nothing should change. Yeah, just turn the monitor around. Every single actual blindfold runner has called it out. And again, this is irrefutable evidence of exactly how she faked it. But why? Why is she not allowed to fake it? What in tarnation? Brother, it's not a crime. She's not going to jail. She can fake it if she wants to, but why does she keep pretending that it's legitimate? She she lied about it. Simple as that. You can still be a fan of her if you want. I don't care. But it's just it's not real. And she keeps pretending that it is, and now her mod's fighting her battles for her. And I know I saw that she does as a fire track. I appreciate it. Thanks, cool. Obviously, she obviously she cheated. Who cares? That's what I'm saying. If she just came out and said, "Yep, I faked it," so what? It would she would probably gain so much more than fighting this losing battle. It's clear she cheated. It has all been put out in the open. Exactly how. To a T and replicated. So just open up to it, admit to it, and you'd be you'd be much better off. You would gain from that as opposed to just continuing to embarrass. I just don't get the point. How did she fake it? Here, I'll just play this little section here. I highly recommend checking out Carl's two videos on it because he does such a great job covering it. But fundamentally, this is what she does. And this guy demonstrates exactly how... Why isn't it loading? Okay. I don't know why this video is not loading. Unfold like this, there we go. knows you don't wear them loose, you wear them tight. If you wear them loose, light gets in. Where is it? This guy did her exact method. Covered up the monitors and everything. So fundamentally, what it is... She leans back, whoops, I'm too far. She leans back in her chair, she wears her blindfold tight so that way she can see out the bottom and to the right. And she has a third monitor right here, which Carl and the community was able to prove beyond a shadow of a doubt because she accidentally read chat messages from a monitor that's off screen and then tried to fake that she read it from over here. So she has a third monitor here that is uncovered and she looks out the bottom of her blindfold, which you can do, which this guy proves you can do with the exact same blindfold and she's able to just see it like that. But again, anyone with a functioning cerebral cortex will be able to know that the things she does in these runs is impossible if you are blindfolded. She is constantly turning her camera to look at the face of the dragon. When she grapples onto the wrong part of the dragon, she immediately ungrapples, which is something she'd have no idea if she was really blindfolded. She would have no clue she didn't grapple onto the head of the dragon. It'd be impossible. It's just blatantly fake. <laughs> But here, she looks out the bottom here at the third monitor. Thanks to resub Rotten Kiwi. I know, that's why we're talking about it, because I was listening to the mod go into an absolute... Like, the mod is trapped in a Genjutsu. The mod that's right now trying to defend her is completely on a different dimension. He's not in reality right now. I'm 100% sure that she'll come back and triple down with another run. I think so too, but there's nothing else she can do. Go to a neutral location, a single monitor, turn the monitor around, or turn it off, you don't need it on. 
set up the kill, turn off the monitor, wear the same blindfold, look straight down, and do it. You don't need to have your head facing forward. If it's blindfolded, that's not doing anything for you. Look straight down and do it. Did she admit to it the first time? No, which is why she did another run. <laughs> she just won't admit to it for some inexplicable reason. Like, there's no reason not to. There's a reason, more controversy, more money. I don't think so, though. She'd gain so much more if she's like, yeah, I fucking faked it. Like I said, I feel like she'd come out much more on top if she's like, yep, I did fake it. Just play the villain. That guy is a classic hornet. Yeah, that one was great. But do you think this is possible to do? I don't know Elatrion at all. I don't know if it's possible blindfolded. I couldn't tell you. Blindfolded runs are possible, though, in other games like Super Mario 64. They use sound cues, which is not what she's doing at all. What do you mean, Damien? If they're sensitive to sounds, it is possible, though. No, it's not, because there's some things that this dragon does that have no sound cues, and she dodges them flawlessly. But her biggest tell, again, is what she does truth, with her camera. I realized this was a giant red herring. <clears throat> if she's blindfolded, her camera, she'll have no idea where it is. It'd be impossible. There's no sound cues for your camera. After several days of brainstorming, I was Let me just show you the dragon part. You hold a thing I needed of the input. Does anyone remember the timestamp for the uh, dragon grapple? I think it's here. He also killed Alatreon in oh, expert no, this fashion. Showing his. It's in weeks, and for that entire time, she all evidence. The fact that we can literally see her move OBS to the hidden screen is impossible to do if you can't. Like she's not even trying to hide it. And beyond all of this, the simple fact remains: the way she played the game is impossible to do if you can't. It's around see. 18 minutes. Now let's be real for a second. At the end of the day, this entire thing isn't a big deal angle before her attempt with the new blindfold she had spent around one hour playing with her old blindfold over multiple days and weeks and for that entire time she always sat like this she was leaning forward this is for the and grapple? looking directly in front of her Things this is beef. because while her blindfold was partially obscuring her sight she could see straight through it and was looking at the monitor directly in front of her with the new blindfold she can't see through the front of it which is why she has now completely changed her sitting position so she can can see down and to the side. This is not a normal way to sit, and world-class blindfold speedrunner Bubsia confirms that when you see someone sitting it, in no, this it's position, not here. Where, it's a giant I'm, I'm talking about flag. for the grapple. And uh, if I curve up even more, but that's already looking very sus, I guess, if you, if you sit there like your neck breaking. Uh, if I sit like this, for example, I can it's see seven minutes in. half of my money. The Treyon's leg. Oh yeah, here. Thank you. Where it could help her aim hey, on the dragon. This would solve the problem of locating the dragon and also solve the vertical aiming issue. However, this wouldn't solve all of the problems, like being able to dodge attacks that don't have sound cues. In one instance, she accidentally hooks onto Alatreon's leg instead of its head and immediately releases before targeting the head again. But there is no audible difference between hooking onto the leg or the head, so there is no way she should have known. In order to solve issues like this, <laughs> I theorized that maybe someone was talking to her like, it's just so blatant. Thanks, Chief. I just don't know why she just doesn't say, like, yep, I fucking cheated. <laughs> like, she'd get so much out of it.
I know. That's why we're talking about it, because I was listening to the mod defend it. Defending the undefendable. No way the mod believes the stuff he's saying. I think he does. I was listening. It really seems like he truly believes it. Which is sad. <laughs> 